Yeah, Mike, Kristen, tonight I spoke to Austin Cousins, former band director who's distraught about his death. Neighbors in the area say they heard shots fired, some sort of verbal altercation, and then more shots fired. I was shocked and I am still um, rather numb, quite frankly to hear what has happened to Austin. Originally from Ohio, Austin Cousins was here in Pittsburgh working at Rockwell Automation. But before that, Austin was a talented and distinguished member of the Purdue trumpet section of the marching band. Austin's history in the Purdue band department was uh, really quite remarkable. He was an he was an incredibly devoted student and um, he was very involved in our program. Um, I just, I can't imagine anything like this would have happened. Jake Ebhardt says there were over 400 members of the Purdue band and the trumpet section was the largest, but Austin stood out. He was an assistant rank leader within trumpets, was a volunteer photographer and a part of the operations team. Um, I, I, honestly, I can't think of a whole lot, uh, a whole lot of students who have been more active in our department than Austin Cousins. His devotion to the band and the type of man he was just makes the situation that much harder for his former band leader to comprehend. For Austin to lose his life this particular way is, in my in my opinion, is just more than tragic. I can't even I can't even process this information knowing the Austin Cousins, who was part of the Purdue All American Marching Band and who was such an incredibly devoted volunteer in our department. I just can't imagine it. Now, Pittsburgh's Action News 4 did ask Allegheny County Police if Cousins opened fire on officers. We're told that county police at this time do not know what transpired, but they are investigating. Reporting live from Allegheny County Police, Yasmin Rodriguez, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.